need to set a up those. Okay, here yeah, another flower tutorial again, guys. Isn't that pretty? Let me show you guys first. I love this color, huh? Yeah, another color. That pretty, I like the side of it, guys. So this, um, definitely you did for sure for my project, guys. Isn't that pretty? So, so pretty. <laughs> I love this guy. This is uh, my favorite, that's uh, the color there. So this tutorial is uh, originally from Lisa So my friend and also my DT member. Thank you, Liz. So, our like she made so beautiful flowers, guys. So, I have to make it. But I use different dyes. She used Tim Hong, I believe. But then, I'm gonna use this dye from Stem Me Up. The Iceland floor. So, I'm not sure. I don't think you can see it. But this is a big flower. And I'm like, I think another flower and the leaves. And the small one, this is the one I'm using because it's going to be this one too big for me to use on my project. So I decided to use this one. So this is a coffee filter, guys. So when you cut out, so you grab a whole bunch of your coffee filter. I actually use the whole of this, not just the bottom. I use all of this. I just cut it in, into this side. And then, oh my god, there's a lot of them, guys. So, I use them all, guys. And when you cut it, <clears throat> it's gonna be like this, right? So, what I'm doing is because this one it doesn't hang on, guys, it love focus. So, then okay, I'm back. It like this, it doesn't have uh, cuts in there, so I'm gonna split between the powder, guys. The reason I'm doing this because when you um, press them, you know, texture them, I mean, curl them, it makes the flower cup higher more, okay? So you will use, um, this I use the total, the, um, the flowers is uh, eight of them, you can use more than that if you want. So I'm gonna, so for one flower, my flower is seven or eggs, so I just separate them, like that guy, dry faster if I separate them guy, five, six, seven, and one more, my coffee powder, okay. So I have total egg of them and I also use the color water like lip this. So I have this um, watercolor since a long time ago. I got this Hobby Lobby. So I have so many different colors that I want to use. Let's see which color I want. So I'm thinking I might want to use this blue here, guys. I haven't used this blue yet, so I'm going to use that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use any sharp. I did my ruler here is kind of sharp. So I'm going to scrape some color. See that, guys. It, I don't know how, what you color you want, you want flower, you know, darker or a little bit light blue, it will give different color, but I think that's it, the water color that I'm going to use now. We're going to use the water. So I'm going to use this, but I'm not going to spray guys, so, but I'm going to uncap this. So I'm going to wet my paddle. 
You can also can go look at this channel for original tutorial, okay? This is my tutorial, guys. It's not much different, it's the same. You get the flower disappear because this is the white into white. So and then I'm gonna use my again pen brush dip in here and I'm gonna start add some color on there guy. Okay. It look really bright, right? But it's not after you it dry guy. I you know put all my watercolor on there and I like to add more water to make sure my watercolors you know blend with the uh, the coffee filter. You can either let it dry by itself or you the heat to and I'm gonna let this one dry and it will be right back. Back, so I need to dry this so it's gonna be like this. And I'm going to use my foam here, the foam mat. And I'm gonna use uh, they call it maybe stylish embossing, I'm not sure. So I'm gonna put it on down and then I'm going to put like this way. Eh? So let the leaves curl up and see that. So you would do all of the uh, the rest of the paddle guy. Okay. okay. Okay, after that I'm gonna use one stamen here, you can use any stamen, it doesn't matter what color, you're not gonna see it because it's inside, right there, you can see it. So I'm gonna fold in half and then I'm gonna use the wet glue. I know I use the wood glue everything guys, everything, so because the Flower will have the hole in it, guys. So, so I'm gonna add a little bit of glue each petal. Not really tell much color, but it will when it put it together, it will show more color. What's well, already show color, guys? not um, a bright color when I paint it straight. Okay, here you go guys. So I just let this one dry like this. That's what Liz said. All right guys, that's it for the um, Thursday my flower tutorial okay and don't forget to check out this channel on my description box and see you next week for another flower tutorial guys thank you everyone for keep watching and i will see you guys later please if you like my video leave your comment and give me a thumb up and share this video for everyone to see it thank you guys for watching i will see you guys later bye bye guys